Greet your patient warmly and politely. Identify your patient. Verify the correct patient using two identifiers. Take an oral informed consent. Explain all the steps of the procedure to your patient or family present. Verify order for manipulation. Check there are no contraindications, allergic reactions. Prepare all the equipment on the procedure trolley. Marked waste containers, disinfectants for surfaces, syringe, ample of vial with medicine, solution for dissolving the medicine, needle, sterile materials, cotton wool balls, phlebotomy arm wage, tourniquet, napkins, adhesive bandage tape, ample cutter. Personal protective equipment. Clarify any inconsistencies. Check sterile equipment, dates of exposure, sterility, perform hand hygiene and apply PPE. Apron, medical plastic sleeves, mask, face shield, gloves. Open the packaging with cotton balls. Use technique from the checklist withdrawn medicine from a vial or ample to prepare syringe for medication. Position the patient and hyperextend the patient's arm. Place the phlebotomy arm wedge under the patient's arm. Apply tourniquet on the arm over a napkin. 7 to 9 cm above the selected site. Closely monitor the arm to ensure that it is not applied too tight for more than 2 minutes. Apply gloves. Clean the skin. The first cotton ball, white by antiseptic, is used for area 10 to 10 cm. The second one, 5 to 5 cm. The direction of cleaning is from periphery to the center. Ensure that the area is dried. Wait for exposure time. Take the cotton ball with antiseptic in your right hand. Hold with force and pips fingers. Take the syringe from the package in your dominant hand. Place the second finger on the hub of the needle. Our fingers are on the syringe barrel. Remove the needle cap with your left hand. Check the position of the needle. Fix the vein in the venipuncture area with your first finger of non-dominant hand. Grab the patient's arm and uncheck the vein from the rolling. Insert the needle at the 15 degree angle into the vessel. You should see the blood near the needle hub. Place the second and third fingers of the left hand on the syringe plunger. 
Draw the blood into the syringe. Release the tourniquet. Draw the blood into the syringe for the second time by pulling the syringe plunger. Place the second and third fingers of the left hand on the syringe barrel, the first finger on the plunger. Inject the medicine slowly without changing the position of the syringe, pressing the syringe plunger with the first finger of the left hand. Leave 0.5 mm of uh, drug in the syringe bar barrel to prevent ear embolism. Remove the needle from the patient's arm and press down on the vessel with cotton wool ball. Tell your patient to apply pressure during 5 minutes not bend the arm. You can put a bandage on the injection site. Put the needle in the continuous sharps, contaminate it. Packages paper will be placed in the container not hazardous waste. Put the syringe in the waste container for contaminated waste. Put cotton balls into the waste container for contaminated waste. Clean apron, sleeves, face shield with disinfectant. After that, rinse with water and dry it. Remove gloves, mask and place in contaminated waste containers. Advise patient to rest for 5 minutes and ensure bleeding has stopped before leaving the site of injection. Perform hand hygiene, register the procedure in the patient chat, observe your patient for allergic reactions.